Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our latest quick look here on the Rosario Network. I'm Dan Webb and joined by Mr. Richard Walker. Hello there. Today we are looking at the Turing test. The Turing, Turing test. test. The Turing test. Turing or Turing? Named after the Enigma cracker fella. Yeah. What uh, cracked the Enigma? So this is a game that I'm billing. Mm hmm. It's portal. Okay. Without portals. Okay, and it's got a gun. It's got a gun. well. It's it's like um, it's an energy gun. Okay. Uh, and it's used to solve puzzles. All right. Then. So the reason I call it Portal Without Portals is that it's basically a series of almost like experiment rooms. Companion cube, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's what yeah. I thought <laughs> straight away. Uh, and mm. you kind of little tests and stuff okay. that you Turing solve. Tests. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But like it, it almost feels like very portal esque. Right. But without the portals. So um, I did a little bit of reading up, and it's it says uh, the blurb said you play as Ava Turing on this space station. Uh, and it's near Ju what is it Jupiter's moon Europa I have no You're idea you'll probably know more than me on this oh, okay. one. I, I know about the game I don't know about I, the, yeah. I literally just read it <laughs> um, so yeah there's two types of um, energy which is teaching you this is right at the beginning okay. so it's teaching you um, a couple of the early puzzles mm -hmm. and you got like, the block energy blocks right which are used to open doors so you slot them in to keys that, and stuff that's these yeah Yeah. Okay. Uh, and you've also got um like the the bolt that you shoot with the gun. Right. Here I'm like, can I throw it? Can I do anything? So I've got there to see what's up. Yeah. So this is basically just raw. Um, I haven't edited it really. I cut a little bit out in the middle where I got really stuck, <laughs> where the game doesn't really explain something, but I'll, I'll talk about that in a bit. Okay. So a lot of the time it's just like you actually see me figure it out. So it yeah. gives you an idea of how the, uh, the puzzles escalate. Ah. So, so you can't throw stuff. No, but you can put it through a window sure and pick it up the other side okay um, that's yeah, how you solve this one like a lot of these puzzles I don't know what the puzzles are like later on in the game right um, but these are all about unlocking doors okay uh, almost like y your test chambers right where you've got to unlock the door to get through and then get the lift to get the next one right so they get increasingly more complex and this game's from the folks behind Numa Breath of Life, right? It Which is. Was a first so person puzzle. Interesting. Uh, British um, developer. Yeah. They talked about it a, li a, a lot, and there's a lot more because of how successful Numa was. Yeah. In terms of monies. Yeah. Um, they were able to make a much better game, they said this time. Okay. Um, cool. They almost insinuated that they did all they could with Numa. Right. Um, with the funding that they had available. Sure. Uh, they were happy with it, they said, obviously. Right, well, um, I didn't think much of it. Yeah, yeah, and not a lot of people did, right? Right, well, I don't know, some people seem to enjoy it, but I just thought it was a bit bleh. Yeah, so look, now we've got different puzzles where it's like, okay, I'm gonna, I can pull that out, mm -hmm. but then it closes that door. Uh, so I'm like, okay, uh, I need this energy to get through to the next door. Can you jump through the window? No, that's what I was trying, and then I was like, can I bounce it off walls? I'm like, no. So I'm like, all right, I'll put it back in. I'll and go scope through the place out, and then I'll just suck it through the window. Ah! So they get like l l some of the the later puzzles. So it's like fifteen minutes long. This video. Yeah. Uh, some of the later puzzles do get really complex. This is the one I got stuck on because they didn't differentiate the difference. Obviously, this is early code. Sure. Um, and I said to them like, I don't quite understand this, but they didn't differentiate the difference between I can shoot power into that hole there. Okay. But I just thought that one was for blocks and one was for power. Right. But no. Oh, um, right. So once I got that, I got through it quite easily. So I'm yeah. like, okay, what I do is, uh, I was talking to somebody here, which is uh, <laughs> just having a chat. Yeah. So I was like, hold on a minute, guys, uh, mm -hmm. and then I just go and put that in there, uh, and I get up. But I was stuck in this room for like 10, 15 minutes. Really? Because I just didn't know that you all could you do. had to do was remove the console, and but I just didn't realise that the two were different. Now right. that I understood that they were almost like yeah. interchangeable. Right. Um, so the majority of the puzzles you did, did they involve those kind of boxes and energy? No. Yeah, okay. they do. But they get increasingly more complex as you go on, like okay. that one. Yeah. Like I need to get it from there, so I need to pull that out there, and I drop that there, so I can fill one with there, and I can put that one uh, in there. Yeah, okay. So it, it's like, it's classic portal. It teaches you a new thing every mm. one until you have to put them all together. Okay. And these switches are a, a thing that become a big part of this now. Right. Uh, basically, you can switch them to do different things. Okay. So that one opens the door. So what I can do is I can take that out of there. I can put that in there. Well, I should be able to put that in there. There you go. 
Uh, and then I can pull the switch. Right? Yeah. And then I can go around the other side. And I can go in here. And I'm like, oh, I need something now. Needs, you need so I can, right, yeah. But I'm like, oh, I can't do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch them around. Oh, you can't draw power from a console. It's no. going to be an exposed port. Yeah, basically, basically, yeah. Right. So I'm like, okay, I've got this. Uh, what I'm going to do is... I can't suck that one. I'm literally going through it in my head. <laughs> yeah. So I'm like, okay. I'll, I can I can almost hear the I'll cogs work. Pull that. Yeah. In there. And no, I still got it wrong. Oh really? What I do is because I need to basically put that in there, which opens that door. Yeah. And put and pull that and put it in there, so I can pull it when I'm inside the other room. Right. So okay. So. Oh yeah. Like that. Gotcha. Like these, oh, they, it's, they, not, it's, it's easy when you know how, isn't it? Yeah, just like absolutely. Yeah, like and later on, it, it gets ridiculous. There's like six doors, and each doors, so you have to kind of work it out almost in reverse. Right. And I'm like, how can I get that one? I need a power one. Um, actually, I think this might be the the last puzzle. Oh, really? But there's a lot. This is like really complex. Did they tell you much about the story or anything, or do you, no. not, do you not really get a sense of it? No, not at all. They were mm. like, "Here's the Turing test." Oh, really? Or Turing test? Yeah. Um, and that was it. Huh. Okay, fair and enough. This isn't the last one, but it's coming up. I guess the full game will, uh, you know, communicate the story. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, this yeah. is just more of an idea to get a feel for the game okay. and its mechanics. Yeah. So obviously. I can use that one there and that one, and then I can pull that one and open that door. Oh, yeah. So, they, you as Nailed you can it. see, they're getting more complex. Yeah. Like, I get the feeling this is the big one. No, actually, no, it's in a bit. But then it teaches you a new mechanic now. Mm hmm. It's like, okay, I've got to get up there. So, if I pull that, that drops. I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, I, already, I can already see what you're doing. Or can I? you got to stand on it for. Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's it. And then move across. And then push myself up. And then move across. Yeah, the same again. I was just making sure. And then, so like, it's it's cool. There's new little kind of huh. mechanics and stuff along the way that keep you, uh, that keep it interesting and keep right. keep it fresh. Uh, I didn't really play Numa. Um, no. So I really don't know how this kind of. Rates on the scale of uh, Numa. Well, but one of my problems with Numa is that there weren't many puzzles where you're actually physically manipulating stuff. There's a lot of stuff where you had to be in sight of these kind of eye sensor things, and it just felt a bit, you know, unsatisfying. So, from what you've seen of this so far, this is more my kind of thing when it comes to puzzle games. Right, and then that's pretty cool. So, you put that up there, and then you, you yeah. drop it on there, and I can let go, go and grab it. Actual like physical objects to manipulate and stuff. It's it's more, more my kind of thing. I was just I didn't realize I could grab that. <laughs> it takes you a while. Like this, it doesn't really telegraph a lot of things. No. Like, I just thought that that was kind of almost being pulled to it with sure. this ridiculous magnet kind of thing. I didn't realize I could just walk in and grab it. Looks like you only really use the X button as well. Doesn't seem like uh, the controls are that complicated. Oh, right and left trigger. Okay. Oh yeah, of course. So you need to just drop that box, right? Yeah, but I'm just trying to work out how I drop that box. But there's no, there's no power source in the magnet this time, or is there? Well, that's what you did last time, yeah, isn't it? You, right? you and that's what lock. I was looking for, which is why I went down and I looked around. I was looking for a power source elsewhere. Mm. I'm fairly sure I just walk in. Because I was like, does that switch do anything? I'm fairly sure I just walk in and jump and grab it. Oh, really? Is it that simple? Oh, yeah. yeah. And I was like, <laughs> what? <Okay. laughs> Sometimes I overthink puzzles. Yeah, me too. I, I have the same problem. Yeah. No, when, the, when the solution's right there. No, I'm like, what the fuck do I do with this? And I'm like, <laughs> oh, I get it. Do I? I don't get it. Oh yeah, yeah, I get it. Put it in there, <laughs> and then move it right across. And then yeah. I should be able to grab it off the other end. I think that's what the, the solution is. Yeah. But it gives you an idea of what of what kind of game it is. It's puzzles. It's it's, mm -hmm. and this is like ten minutes in. I'm assuming the game is like at least a few hours long. Yeah, it's going to steadily ramp up, right? Yeah. You well, you'd hope so, right? Yeah. Um. So imagine what it's going to be like an hour in. Yeah. 
So, but yeah, I, think, and I get a feeling it's the next room that where it gets really complex, and that's the last of the kind of the puzzles. Um, okay. I said, like, oh, power source. <laughs> yeah, this is it. It's like there's three doors. Yeah. And not a lot of power. Right. So obviously, if I pick that up and I put it in there. Mm -hmm. So like, I literally for the first couple of minutes of this, I'm exploring. I'm seeing right. Where do I need to get power from? Yeah. Where do I need to get it to? And I'm like, okay, now. I need that power clearly to put in the door. Uh -huh. But in order to get that power in the door, I need to get two to open the door. So I'm like, okay, I can pull that one. Mm -hmm. But what do I do with that one? And I'm like, okay, let's go in there. I can pull that one out the wall, but I can't withdraw the power from it. So you see, like, and you can't put that in there. But I can't put yeah. that in there. So I'm like, so you, okay, I yeah. need to switch basically. And then I realised that's the way I came. <laughs> so it's all, and sometimes it's just about switching the, the power sources. Do you know what else? I can tell you're very aware that this is being captured. <laughs> Why? Well, because you want to get it right, don't you? Well, I don't. Or are you just, are you, or is that my imagination? Well, I'm, I'm just, you just try, trying to yeah. work out the puzzle. Of course. <laughs> it doesn't matter whether it's being captured like, or not. My I objective is... I don't want to look stupid. That's what I'd be thinking. Really? Yeah, I'd be thinking, I don't want to look like an idiot. Well, this is actually quite complex. There's a lot yeah. of like, lights and stuff, so I'm like, okay. Okay. If I, that's a port. Like, yeah, that in there, right? Yeah, and then yeah, I'm that like, okay, right. that, that opens right. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, uh, actually, this took me a while. And I'm like, I need... I need why did you so decide not to... Has that got to have a power thing? No, nah, yeah. Like, I'm, I was just working out what it did. Right. But basically, I need to be able to clean that room of power. Mm -hmm. So I need to be able to get that out so I can use the power on a later puzzle. Right. And in order for me to get that out, that controls the window. Yeah. Uh, like the shutter. So I'm like, okay, in order for me to get oh, that so out, get I that need... to chuck that over, right? Well, yeah. no. What I need is um, one of the energy bolts oh, yeah, that yeah. I can grab with a gun. Then, like, I mean, that just shuts off the power for everything. So I'm like, right, right yeah. I need to find in. an energy bolt that I can leave in there. Well, there's one. But at this point, I still hadn't worked it out. But that's with hindsight. Yeah. I know that's what I needed to do. So I went, I went looking for another power oh, source. Okay. <laughs> and I'm like, All right, it, no, I'm, I'm not stuck. You're locked in because I thought that it might lock me off if I hadn't yeah. done something and brought something with me. I see what you mean with the portal comparisons as well, because it's like you're in the test chamber and this is it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And you're like the kind of lab rat. So I, I, I think I eventually work it out. I'm like looking, I'm working it out, and I'm like, hold on a minute. I can put that in there, can't I? But I'm like, <laughs> actually, let me go and get the power first. Yeah. Store it on the wall Grab to the left. that. Oh, can you? Gra oh, drop yeah, yeah, it yeah. down. Okay. Put that in there. That powers it. I get yeah. to take the cube out. Drop yeah. the cube on the floor. I actually I'll put the cube in there, in there. Yeah. And then I can do that, push that, open the shutter, yeah. pull out the power. Excellent. That's, and, that's one. For and then the, that's the that door, room empty of power. So, yeah. okay, I can move on. So I need... Now I need another one. Yeah, but I can take that out and put it back in the, the other door. Ah, uh, yeah. And then I can move on through. My nice little swivel. I like this. Good, good logic puzzles. Yeah, right? Yeah. And then I'm like, okay, I need two to get into there to get that power. So I've got one. Where do I get the other one from? The one on the right. And I'm like, I'm like, is that got power? Oh. And then I'm just slowly working out of my head. I'm like, that room's empty. Yeah, can you? But then I'm just checking. I'm like, is that room empty? Can I take that block? <laughs> so I, I can't that, actually remember can what I've done. There? I can. And then can't you take, can you get in and get that other one that's up there? I, I think I just... That one. Can you get through that window? No, I can't do anything. I thought there might have been a lever there, but there wasn't. All right. I think what I need to do is... Actually, I can't mm. remember. But like, it's quite tricky. Like, I need yeah. to get a power su supply from somewhere. Okay. And I, I think that might be it. But then how... If, I, if I switch them around... And I'm like, did I miss anything in there? <laughs> and I'm like, no, I definitely didn't miss anything in there. No, 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 you got everything out, didn't you? I genuinely can't remember how I did this, but I did do it. Yeah, I'm, Rest I'm looking assured. at it and I, I don't, I don't understand. I would have tried going through the window, but it's not. I no, guess it's, no. You can't do anything. I think, I think I'm like, okay, let's take that back. What the what? And then I was like stuck. 
taking it again. But then I'm just taking like, it can I, uh, okay. oh yeah. If I take that up there, so obvious now. But is it? Yeah, because you can plug that in now. Go back, grab that power, and do the same on the other door, and then you got the other console thing, haven't you? I think so. I think that's what I did, right? Yeah. So yeah, take that. Oh, just yeah, just. Oh, that yeah, in. that's yeah. what I did, right? There you go. And then I've got another power source, which I can then open. So then you got your two. The last one, I do believe. And yeah, and that is turn test. Uh, it's out August thirtieth. It's made by Bulkhead Interactive. The Numa people. Yeah, and uh, thanks for watching, folks. And we'll see you next time. Cheers. Thank yeah, you. thanks Bye. a lot. Bye. See ya.